What you see now does not require any comment. The whole world recognizes aviation and astronautics as the next generation branches of science. Combining creativity, cutting edge science, and the latest technology. In these sophisticated ballet pirouettes, the fighting machine demonstrates grace, power, and strength, merged at the peak of human genius. Hundred years since the first aircraft flight, and throughout all of that time, we have been creating the future of aviation and aeronautics. We are Kharkiv Aviation Institute, now the National Aerospace University, named Fazhukovsky. We are in Ukraine, the state formed in the center of Europe after the breakup of the Soviet Union, for the training of aerospace science and technology. Hi, I'm Anurga Shrida. I'm from India, and I'm studying at the Faculty of Airplanes and Helicopter Designing. I chose an uncommon field for girls, airplanes designing. I love sky and airplanes and I enjoy studying in this university. We are staying at hostel and it is located close to the university. I have a lot of friends here and we enjoy time together. Today, PAI is accredited at level 4, the highest level by the government of Ukraine. It is one of the three most popular technical universities in Ukraine and is a member of UNESCO International Association of Universities. HIE offers bachelor's, master's, PhD, and doctor of engineering degrees. Its 12,000 undergraduate and graduate students study in the seven faculties, 50 majors, and 44 departments of the university, supported by 850 instructors and a staff of 2,000. Now we'll try to briefly present the key elements of our university. The Faculty of Aircraft Design was formed in 1930. Today, it trains specialists in the following majors. Airplane and Helicopter Design, Aircraft Manufacturing, Information Technology Design, Aircraft Maintenance, Alternative Energy Sources, ecology and environmental protection. A distinctive feature of the Faculty of Aircraft Design is its high standards and deep traditions. The faculty has modern equipment, a professional approach. It has a strong connection with manufacturing, including a branch at the Construction Bureau Antonov in Kyiv. The faculty is equipped with wind tunnels, construction halls, and computing facilities. IE takes pride in its graduates. Among them are General and Chief Designers of Aviation Technics, major company officials, public officials, and two heroes of Ukraine. The Faculty of Aircraft Engines is the oldest in the university, as powerful engines have always been the heart of winged machines. Today, the faculty trains master's students in the following majors aircraft engines and power plants, aircraft engine manufacturing, aerospace heat engineering, gas turbine plants and compressor stations, and robotics. The training laboratories of the faculty include gas turbine and piston aircraft engines and also diagnostic testers. The department's training and scientific activity is closely connected with the leading industrial giants of Ukraine. No modern aircraft can do without reliable control systems. And the Faculty of Aircraft Control Systems was founded in 1977 during the period of rapid development of aviation and astronautic systems. The faculty trains students in the following majors. Aircraft and Aviation Complex Control Systems, Automation and Control Systems, Information Control Systems and Technologies, Information Measuring Systems, Metrology and Measuring Equipment, Applied Mathematics, and Computer Integrated Technological Processes in Production. This faculty is engaged not only in aircraft and space control systems, 
but also in computerizing scientific research, manufacturing, technological processes, and in organizational management, and non-conventional measuring and testing. In the 1940s, Haiyi started to train specialists in space rocket engineering. The Faculty of Space Rocket Engineering trained students in rocket and space systems, aircraft rocket engines, aircraft power plant and engines, and the design and manufacture of products made with composite materials, and the information technology of the sun. Graduates of the faculty make Ukraine today one of the leading space states in the world, producing unique space objects and launching them both alone and through the programs of international cooperation. These graduates took part in designing missile carriers, missiles, and space objects ranging from artificial Earth satellites to manned space stations. IE graduate Oleg Kononenko completed a prolonged space flight to the International Space Station in 2008 that included two spacewalks. As you know, modern aircraft cannot do without communication and onboard computer systems. For over 40 years, the Faculty of Aircraft Radioelectric Systems has trained specialists in a range of majors related to the electronics of aircraft and spacecraft, but also to the manufacturing of other products. The faculty trains graduates in the following majors. Production of electronic devices, biotechnical and medical devices and systems, radioelectric devices, systems and complexes, technologies and means of communication, specialized computer systems, computer systems and networks, and geoinformation systems and technologies. The scientific laboratories of the university have been engaged in space research and international collaboration, and also medical diagnostic research. High age students also study modern banking, finance, enterprise economics, and insurance dealership. Graduates of the faculty have excellent foreign language and computer skills. Specialists from companies, banks, and stock exchanges are involved in teaching at the faculty. While studying, students are trained in engineering. Many of the faculty's graduates work in many of the following countries in the world. The faculty trains specialists in the following majors. Organizational management, finance, enterprise economics, software of automated systems, project management, and international economy. Heine's newest faculty is the Faculty of Humanities. It was formed in 1999 in connection with global processes taking place in Ukraine and also the integration of education within the European community. The faculty trains students in the following majors, psychology, and applied linguistics. Apart from that, the National Aerospace University has a corresponding faculty where 5,000 students are trained. Heine is a joint participant in the many scientific projects done together with universities and companies from Russia, the USA, Japan, Germany,